Well, the name of pickleball. A U.S. congressman in, from the state of Washington and his best friend decided they were going to make a game that youngsters could play along with their grandparents, you know, multi-generational. And the congressman had a dog named Pickles, and Pickles kept chasing the ball all the time. So there, there's the name, Pickleball. <laughs> yeah, I came over here to sign up for volleyball one evening, and uh, there was a sign out front for Pickleball. So I showed up the next night, and uh, these guys, Tom, Charlie, Wayne, introduced me to the sport. I bought a paddle at night, so I've been playing ever since. <laughs> Pickleball is a combination of badminton, tennis, and ping pong, or table tennis. Uh, the paddle is a little bit over, oversized ping, ping pong paddle, and uh, the tennis is the, the net is low like tennis, and badminton size court. I think I'm most competitive with myself. I want to get back out there real quick to see if I can straighten up what I messed up on the last game. I think uh, depth perception and eye-hand coordination, because I'm a runner. I like to jog, but this is helping my eye-hand coordination tremendously. Pickleball is like I'm a little kid again. It's like I'm out in the backyard playing with my brothers and sisters again. So I, it's like a fun thing. And as, as I go to walk out of the door, you say, but wait a minute, I got another game that I'd like you to try called pickleball. I say, oh no, man, I don't want to play anything like that. Pickleball, that sounds crazy. He said, well, just come to the gym. I'm having a tournament this weekend. Come to the gym and look at it, and then you decide. So I go to the gym on Saturday, and I was shocked. Ladies, 50, 60, 70, even 80 something years old, playing this game, pickleball. I'm like, what is this? Immediately, I knew that that was a sport for me because I'm over 50 now, and you know my uh, limitation is getting kind of closed in on me. Yes. Ha ha. What? Yes, good. That's what I said. Yes. <laughs> I happen to be the local Baton Rouge ambassador for the United States of America Pickleball Association (USAPA). And I'm also the regional ambassador, which is a six-state region that I'm kind of in charge of. We have tournaments, uh, and, and a lot of us play in the uh, senior Olympic tournaments here in Baton Rouge and New Orleans, Lafayette, and Indiana games. And we also put on what's called the Mid-South Region Tournament. Uh, we've had it in Baton Rouge for the last two years. And we have a strong group of players uh, in number-wise from along the I-10, I-12 corridor, from Lafayette to Mandeville. Right. I'm a captain at Hunts Correctional Center. I brought a crew of people from the U.S. Pickleball Association, some of these guys that play right in here, brought them to the gym. Everybody comes out of the dormitory. What is this? Blew up. Now you see all the guys, 50, 67, 80, even 90 some years old, coming out of the dormitory with their little shorts on, their little shirts on, you know, they bouncing down the walk, going to the gym, playing pickleball. It is awesome. It really is. You have to see it to believe it. I would say come to this pickleball uh, court because you have a lot of people that are patient and good teachers like Corny Wells and Tom and all these the people that have been playing here for a long time, they're, they will come down and teach you if you don't know anything about it. If you try it, I assure you, you'll love it. And it's just so beneficial. The benefits are just, you know, out the window from playing this sport here. And then, of course, the people. The group of people that you meet in this sport here, you know, it's not like a rowdy group or a bunch of people raising hell. You never hardly hear anybody raise their voice. It's always laughing and giggling because the ball does so many crazy things with those holes in it. Once you hit it, you know, it's no telling where it's going to go. So it's always funny. Something will always happen. Listen, it's just continuous. It's continuous fun. It's just that type of sport. 